Hey everybody, how y'all doing? It's me, Wiggle One. Um, sorry, I do everything without a script because I feel it's more natural when you don't stare and write things down and read off a piece of paper. A piece of paper, but I noticed lately I've been coming close to the thirty thousand subscriber mark, and I think I'm at twenty nine thousand eight hundred or so right now. I just wanted to get it out early because I didn't want to keep waiting anymore until I actually hit 30,000 just to say thank you. I mean, 30,000 of you actually like what I have to put out? You don't know how much it means to me. I didn't, I didn't even expect 30 people years ago would even like what I had to make and enjoy actually watching my videos. Um. I'm sorry, I have a lot of moments of silence or not knowing what to talk about. But it just makes me feel really cared about and happy that that many people actually enjoy watching what I have to put out. And I could never thank you guys enough for being here and watching my stuff and liking what I do. I know that sometimes my video, I might go a long time without uploading a video due to problems I'm having or real life and stuff like that or I'm running out of ideas, sometimes that happens too, but I know that, oh what do I know, I've been trying my best to upload as much as I can and actually expand how, what kind of videos I make, I know I do make my 8-bit mu music, I make extended versions of songs, let's play videos, what else do I do, reaction videos, stuff like that, and I try to get a whole good of variety out there so that there's a little bit of something that everybody can enjoy. I'm still working on my animation skills because that would be what I would really love to be known for, at least be able to do, is make animations that you guys can watch and enjoy and share with your friends. I know a lot of you watch my extended videos, a lot of you watch my 8-bit videos, depending on who you are. I just can never be more grateful for having the fans that I do that actually enjoy what I have to make. I know I sound like a broken record, but it just makes me so happy that I actually have that many people that care about me at least as a YouTuber that and they like what I put out. I know some of the some of you subscribers actually know me in person. And if you see this video and you know me in person, give me a hug. I want a hug. <laughs> but um, I know I'm not. I I didn't really have anything too big a plan. Kind of like you know people do that huge spectacular 10,000, 50,000 subscriber special type thing where they go all out and do something huge, but I know I don't always have the ability to really do anything big. I don't always have the friends to help or the resources needed, so I just made a couple things for you that I figured you can enjoy. Um, if you want to see the two little somethings I threw together for you, why don't you click on each one of these Game Boys and hear what I made for you. I have too many of these things. Have you ever noticed? You think I have too many Game Boys? I just need more cartridges to make the songs on. I do like my music. I just wish it didn't take so long to make 8-bit music, but... Good things take time. Um... And now I'm just having moments of silence. I do a lot of unedited stuff, like... If you watch people like Boogie29888 or PewDiePie, Markiplier, big YouTubers like that, I mean, they, I think, Boogie's not, but I know like Markiplier and PewDiePie, sometimes they're like heavily scripted or, they're, you, ne you never see moments of silence. Like, if you're watching a Let's Play, like let's say you're watching a Five Nights at Freddy's video of one of them or something like that, you know, you will never see them in a moment where they're really not saying anything because they just will cut out parts of their video with silence, but I like to do the whole unedited thing. Yeah, I know sometimes the video can be long, but I feel like there's more 
of an emotional connection or you can actually sympathize or relate with the person if you're just sitting there in real time watching how they feel or how they're reacting, stuff like that. That's why I know I'm sometimes I even in my new anthology reaction video I can go like 10 minutes without seeing a single thing because you know I, there's I, it's not like I need to be screaming and laughing and make corny jokes every single time there's something interesting on the screen not everything's funny and not everything's worth flipping out about but man I got off topic but I just wanted to make this little something just to say thank you for actually being a part of my channel and liking what I have to make. And hopefully in the future I can just continue to do what I love to do and not end up losing stuff. Personal issues. I made a video about that. I, mean, I don't want to talk about that now. I just know I'm hope in the future I might lose my internet connection so I'm I gotta figure that one out. How am I gonna make YouTube videos if I lose my internet connection at home? So, that's gonna be a tough one. I'm gonna have to go to a McDonald's or something to upload a YouTube video. <laughs> what a pain. Oh well. Thank you guys for watching my videos and thank you so much for actually helping me reach 30,000 subscribers. Wow. I never thought. I would even have like, I remember when I made a 3,000 subscribers special, I think it was like two years ago, and I bet my two year ago younger self would have flipped out if he knew I was going to get 30,000 subscribers. Jeez, I didn't think I made videos that entertaining, I mean, I just make little music on a Game Boy. Or, reaction videos, but even my reaction videos aren't the best. I'm, it's not like I'm flipping out and I, I stink at making jokes sometimes. I mean, I'm no good at doing stuff first impressions. Like, yeah, if I want to sit down and write jokes, yeah, maybe I can do that, but then it doesn't sound real. It just sounds like I had somebody write my comedy for me and I don't really like that. It's like, it makes me wonder, how did I, how did 30,000 of you actually like my stuff? Because, I mean, the only videos I have that have more than 30,000 views are, like, my extended songs. You guys really like my extended music, like, somehow, my Equestria Girls extended live action music video has, like, 12 million views. Wow. And it's still making views, and that live action music video came out before the first Equestria Girls movie did three years ago. Wow, and I, I didn't even think, I thought everybody by now has seen that video. Are, are you guys like watching it every day, or watching it all the time? Are you really addicted to that song, or what? I know the third live action music video I just uploaded yesterday, or whenever, or August 21st, depending on when you're watching this video. At least I hope today's the 22nd, so I got that date right. <laughs> Anyways, um, thank you for watching my stuff. Again, I can never thank you enough times. I mean, nobody could ever be thankful enough. I know sometimes I can say thank you too much, but can you really say thank you too much? Hmm. Well, I hope you guys enjoy the little somethings I threw together for you, the little 8 bit songs I did, and. I just wanted to put together a couple little somethings. I mean, if I had the animation skills, I probably would have tried to do one of those, or... I never was really the best at coming up with video ideas. I'm glad I at least learned how to do 8-bit, because that gives me something to... I do like the long projects. They take me a long time to do. Usually, for the most part, I do like them, because it makes you feel so good when you're finally done with them and you can just share them with the public and say, look what I did! And people are like, oh my god, it sounds so awesome, I love it, please make more, and I'm like, yay, I'm gonna make more. So it's weird, I swear, sometimes the videos, like the music, I spend like 25 hours on and they only get a few thousand views, but somehow the 
videos I can put together in less than an hour, like that live, that Equestria Girls extended music video, I finished in like an hour and 12 million views and I think the other live action one has like over a million views. I'm like, okay, so the videos I throw together get a lot of views, but the ones I work really hard on get just a few thousand. I don't mind. It's not going to stop me from making those videos that take me a long time. I don't... A lot of people I know in real life keep telling me, why do you keep making them? You don't get any... you don't get no money off of them. I don't care. I make... I if I didn't make a single dime off of YouTube videos, I would still make YouTube videos. I don't make music or videos for the sole purpose of hoping to gain money out of it. That's I think that's being a sellout and that that usually involves a huge decrease in quality in your videos. Don't make videos because you expect to make money on them. Then you don't actually like making the videos. You just want money. Don't do it. It's nice to get some money because it helps me pay bills, mortgage, car insurance, cell phone. You know, it's nice. It is nice to make money, but I'm not gonna stop making videos if I stop making money. That's that's dumb. I didn't even I didn't start YouTube with the intent on making money because back in 2007 when I started YouTube, you couldn't even make money on YouTube videos. That wasn't even a thing yet. And then I become eligible for monetization like in 2010, but even then it took me I think six months to finally reach the hundred dollars that you need for Google to give you money. I was like, oh my god, money! But it's nice to get the money, but it's not the sole reason I make any of my videos. But any of that's enough rambling. I mean, what? 12 minutes? Wow. Um, I'd love to know if you actually made it to the end of this video, because listen to a guy ramble for like 13 minutes. Now that's a real, that's a real fan right there. Listen to somebody just talking about nonsense for that long. But anyways. I hope you guys have a good day, evening, morning, night, afternoon, I think I mentioned them all. And I just hope you have a good time in general and thank you for checking out my stuff and being a fan and hope you continue to be a fan or if you're not I hope you become one. Check out my 8-bit songs or my extended videos, reactions, see if you like them. Check out all my stuff, except my really old stuff because my really old videos kind of stunk. There was really I had a very low quality camera and capture card. So some of those old videos, I don't delete them just for nostalgia purposes, but I don't like them. <laughs> There's really no point to them. But anyways, have a good rest of your day, evening, morning, night, afternoon. And hope you have a good day and thank you for watching my stuff.